Thank you, Garrett. A West Side boxing program now without a gym after it went up in flames early this morning. The executive director upset and discouraged, telling the night team's Jaffney Gray the kids now have nowhere to train. This is part of our boxing youth program. Uh, this was actually our weight room. What was once a hub that built self-esteem in the youth on the West Side. It's terrible. I mean, it was a startle this morning, waking up and standing and seeing smoke everywhere. Burned to the ground. Uh, man. Uh, so this is the this is this is a, um, our workout equipment, um, a treadmill, and where they do their pull-ups. Executive director for the Advocate Boxing Youth Program, Jason Mata. I'm, I'm pretty pissed off right now. Says the gym was an important part to several in the community. It's giving them an outlet, showing them that there's other people that care about them, keeping them till where they go to high school and go to college. Fire officials have not yeah. confirmed how the fire started, but Mata and others in the area believe it was intentionally set. It is a total tragedy for 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 the kids, not for me. I don't, you know, I could work out outside. This was their thing. Somebody could have gotten killed here. And this is no, no, this is no laughing matter. This is serious stuff. Mata says, though he's unsure on how they will rebuild from here, he hopes city officials will invest more resources in the West Side community for the sake of our youth. This is just another challenge that we got to deal with, but we'll deal with it together. So we should be okay. Jaffany Gray, KSAT 12 News. Now, Mata says he has met with city officials to see what can be done to have more police patrols in the area. The cause of the fire remains under investigation tonight.